What is up guys, Jav here, back today, jumping into Destiny 2. Now in our video today, we're taking a look at the best way to farm out the cold front submachine gun and the avalanche heavy machine gun. So if you're chasing those two weapons down, then this is the video for you. Now, if you enjoyed the video, be sure to leave a rating down below. That super helps me out here on the channel. And if you're new around here, want to keep up to date with all the latest Destiny 2 content, then you're in the right place and be sure to hit subscribe as well. But without further delay, let's jump into the video. So first things first, as always, what is the cold front? This is an aggressive frame submachine gun with high damage and high recoil. I had one drop with Feeding Frenzy, where kills with this weapon increase the reload speed for a short time, alongside Vorpal Weapon, which increases damage against bosses, vehicles and guardians with their super active. So not the greatest roll as you can see, which is why it's worth farming this one out. Moving on to the Avalanche, then this is a heavy machine gun. My one has extended magazine, where this weapon has a greatly increased magazine size but reloads much slower, alongside Feeding Frenzy, where kills with this weapon increase the reload speed for a short time, and finally Rampage, where kills with this weapon temporarily grant increased damage, which stacks up to three times, and I have a Rampage spec mod as well. Now to farm this one out guys we're going to jump into the sundial activity which you can find over on the north side of mercury on the director and the two ingredients that we're looking for in here is cabal oil and multifaceted flavors now cabal oil will be easy to come by because the sundial is pretty much 90 percent cabal and multifaceted flavors is what you get for multi kills and because it's a six player activity it's a very easy one to gather in this activity all in all Loadout wise, I was running a scout rifle, SMG and a machine gun. I found they dropped more often from weapon kills than ability kills. So all in all, you want to farm the activity over and over again. That will grant those two ingredients that you need alongside up to 15 Essence of Dawning, which again is a key ingredient when it comes to baking particular treats. So with those ingredients in mind, let's have a look at our Eva oven then. So we have Cabal Oil there. We got 33 already and 30 multifaceted flavors. So we combine that with Essence of Dawning. We have ourselves a hackberry tart now with that ingredient now discovered we can quickly create these by using the option down here and you basically just want to create as many hackberry tarts as you can all in all here i'll be able to create roughly 11 hackberry tarts but once you've created as many as you can we are going to jump over to the tower and we're going to visit our friend benedict who you can find over in the annex so once here we're going to hand in all our treats to benedict what we're looking for here now is a gift in return you'll get a few trash blue items but then aside you should get one or two gifts in return now once you've handed in all your treats you want to head over to your inventory and here you'll be able to find those gifts themselves so if we open these ones up so we've got an avalanche on our first one and for the second one we have ourselves a cold front so as you can see there out of two gifts i managed to obtain both weapons so we have a quick look at this one so we've got auto loading holster on this one which isn't a fantastic role and avalanche which has feeding frenzy and high impact reserves so all in all not great roles but a reason to farm them out nevertheless so there we have it guys that's how you can farm out the two weapons from this season's dawning event i hope you have found the video useful if you have be sure to leave a rating down below that super helps me out here on the channel and if you're new around here and want to keep up to date with all the latest destiny 2 content then be sure to hit subscribe as well i'm going to jump back into the game as always guys but i will catch you all again very soon